Now that we've nailed down, moving forward and back, moving left and right, blocking, slipping, rolling, jab, cross, hooks, uppercuts. And then we've done our little movements of one, two, one to six. We're going to practice a little bit of shadow boxing. But for this tutorial of shadow boxing, we're only going to keep it to one punch. It can be whatever punch you want, just at random, throw it out, find your rhythm, and have fun with it. Also notice what punches you're not good at, what punches you are good at. And take note of your good punches and your bad punches. Just so you know. So, boom. We like to jab. We like to keep a fast jab. 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 Always remembering the techniques from the last. Boom. Jab. Jab. We always imagine that there's an opponent in front of you. And I'm looking for the shots. You know? Moving, rolling, stepping, finding your, finding your little bit of rhythm so you can have fun, find that flow. Up. Constantly moving, constantly trying to better ourselves, trying to become the best version that we can. Now, these classes are for self defense. You don't go around beating people up just because you learn a few moves. If you want to fight, Go to a boxing gym, or a kickboxing gym, or an MMA gym, and then you'll find somebody that wants to fight. Nobody likes fucking bullies. Go around picking on people for no fucking reason. So make sure, if you want to be a hard man, and you want to put these skills to practice on another person, go to a gym. There's plenty of gyms. I'm sure there's loads of people. In the gyms that are willing to fight. And that's it.